Hey guys, it's Jason here. It's Monday, it's a new week, and we're ready to get this thing started. Welcome to the channel. Man, oh man, what a gorgeous day it is today. Hey guys and gals, thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you had an opportunity to see our video of getting our new dog. Uh, that video is called Meet Gracie, and it uploaded last night, which is Monday night. It is out of the normal realm of things that I do on this channel, but it is something that's still important to me and to my family. So if you haven't seen it yet, please go take a look when you're done watching this video, and I'll put the information uh, at the end. So thanks again for tuning in, and I hope you really appreciate some of the work that went into uh, making that little video happen. So today we are celebrating. And the reason why we're celebrating is because every once in a while you have a vehicle that you sit on for a really long time and in the industry we call them dogs so today we sold a dog it's the 2015 Buick Verano and we've been sitting on this thing for a while and we had one of our regular customers come in and uh, decided it was time to upgrade and I give her one heck of a deal on it just basically move it out so that we can uh, you know use that money to go buy something that will maybe sell a little bit quicker anyways not sure really why the car sat so long, but uh, Buicks do tend to be a little bit of a uh, oddity sometimes. You just need to have the right person come in that wants a Buick. Buicks aren't today what they were years ago, an old person's car. They, they tend to be quite a nice little car. So anyways, we've got it sold. We're going to take it down, fill her up full of gas, get her washed up. There goes the dog. So I've been keeping an eye on Gracie, our new dog, with the uh, webcam that we have set up in the living room. And she's been crying and whining and whimpering all morning. So I'm going to have to go home and let her out of the cage and see how she makes out. Hopefully we can get her feeling a little bit better about staying home. And hopefully Sadie, the other dog, will keep her company because she's nowhere to be found on that webcam. Hey, sweetheart. Where's Sadie? There she is. Hi, sweetheart. Bouncy. Someone's excited to see us. So I'm just sitting here in the kitchen catching up on YouTube, some of the guys that I follow. And uh, one of the fellas, his name is Dylan McCool. He's got 46,000 subscribers and he does a lot of Dodge product, a lot of Dodge, uh, you know, buys an old car, tries to get it running, stuff like that. And at the end of each of his videos, he features one of his fans, one of his followers. Because he's doing a 78 Chrysler Cordova uh, budget sleeper project, I guess you'd call it, um, I sent him off an email uh, just letting him know a little bit about mine and he asked me for pictures of it. So I sent him pictures and guess what? Check this out. Send me an email with your projects. Thank you so much again and I will see you in the next one. So one of the reasons why I will send emails out or try and contact some of these guys via Facebook or Messenger or what have you, and the reason why I sent send it Steve some license plates for his office, and the reason why I sent out Street Speed 717 a t-shirt is because these guys have a huge following, and if I can get a shout out or a mention in some way, then that allows me to get my name out there too and hopefully start growing subscribers. Now you know the rest of the story. Good morning guys. It is Wednesday morning and the 2014 
forward escape has an appointment next door at Cox Electronics to get a remote start put it up. So we're just going to get it started up here and get the frost off the windshield so that uh, I can drive it over there next door and uh, be able to see. Good morning, sir. <laughs> Jeez. Thanks so much. Hey, thank you. Uh, neighbor. Neighbor. We're just over here at Cox Electronics picking up our 14 Ford Escape with the new remote start. And if this thing works like it's supposed to, it works like a charm. Big shout out to Trevor for getting this thing all wired up perfectly as normal. And thanks to Rob for getting it in on such a short notice. So guys, we are about to go live on Facebook to give away a prize pack from one of our warranty companies, Lubrico Warranty. And we've got a hat, we've got one of my t-shirts, we've got a windbreaker, a Lubrico coffee cup, and a $25 Visa gift card. I'm about to go Facebook Live and I'll let you guys in on what's going on as well. Nanette Giddens, congratulations, you are the winner of this prize pack. Thanks again guys, we really appreciate all your business and we'll see you next time with the next giveaway. And that's how we give away stuff at Old Car Auto. So one of our town's little best kept secrets has uh, opened up for the seasons. We're gonna hit it. King Street Takeout. The last couple of days there's been a post going around Facebook about a local business that got, uh, that got stolen from. And the lady that stole, she said she was hard to miss. She had pink hair and a braid. There she is. She deserves it. Once again, you can tell it's Chase the Ace night. He just won $280,000 as the jackpot as well as the $51,000 just for having his ticket pulled. Way to go Jamie, best of luck man. Well would you look at that, a storm day. Yep. And they cancelled school. It's crazy. But they'll cancel school for. So I guess I'm expected to either move Junior's truck or squeeze the Dodge Dart out of that. I'm up for a challenge. Challenge accepted and defeated. No scratches, no scratches, no scratches, and no damage. So take that, Sherry Dawn. Little Miss Perfect Driver. Okay, guys, that is it for this upload. If you like what you see, please give us a big thumbs up. If you want to see more videos, click on the box right here. And if you want to subscribe, click the bubble right there. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next upload.